In good health, it is a stunning look at just how inactive yeah. many of today's teenagers really are. Maybe that's not surprising to a lot of parents, but let's talk to Dr. Frank Me George with the new research that has an awful lot of people talking. Definitely, Karen and Devin. You know, consider this. Researchers from Johns Hopkins found that on average, today's 19-year-olds are about as active as sedentary 60, 60-year-olds. And that has major implications in terms of their health and our nation's losing battle with obesity. The study looked at more than 12,000 people aged 6 to 84. Participants wore activity trackers to log how much time they spent sitting or being active. Not surprisingly, people tended to get less active as they got older, with a big slowdown starting at age 35. But researchers were surprised to find the average 19-year-old was about as active as sedentary 60-year-olds. Experts say teens should be getting at least an hour of moderate to vigorous exercise every day. Ideally, it's at least 60 minutes a day of physical activity and we want them to be active, you know, getting sweaty, getting short of breath, like really pushing in, trying to do the most that they can. The study found 50% of teen boys and 75% of teen girls were missing that one hour mark. With more than 12 million U.S. children and teenagers now considered to be obese, that puts them in an increased risk for heart disease, stroke, type 2 diabetes, and cancer. Experts say screen time is often a major factor in teen inactivity. Setting limits, healthy limits for screen time, making sure that your kids aren't sitting around all day long on their screens, um, you know, trying to encourage them in any way that you can to get outside and do more activity. Now, a lack of sleep may also be contributing to teen inactivity. Experts really stress it's easier to maintain good habits than to break bad ones. So it's important for children to be active and eat healthy from an early age. And of course, for good health to be a family affair.